Hi guys, this is Speak About Digital, and in this video, I'll show you a simple way on how to build a feedback app. First, what you want to do is just scroll down below this video to the description and click on the first link you find there. Then, you're going to come across this platform, Glide. Glide is a platform that lets you create custom apps without coding. So, after clicking the link in the description, now you need to sign up to Glide. You can choose to sign up with your Google or your email address. Once you have completed the sign-up process, you will be directed to your Glide account. Now, building a feedback app in Glide is a straightforward process that allows you to gather valuable input from your audience about a specific product. Begin by locating and clicking on the Templates option in the left menu, which will direct you to your template page, showcasing your existing templates. To access more options, proceed to the Template Store. In the template store, you'll find the templates are sorted into various categories, easily browsable from the left menu. Alternatively, use the search bar to find specific templates. For this task, enter the keyword feedback to locate feedback app templates. Select any template from the search results. We'll use the first template titled feedback for this guide. Upon making your selection, you'll be redirected to a new page displaying two options. Create this app and preview. Click on Create this app to move forward, which will bring you to the editor for further customization. The editor features a top bar with three layouts data, layout, and action. Data allows you to modify the app template's data. Layout enables you to personalize the app's design, including navigation and product settings, with previews available in both mobile and desktop mode. And action provides options for adding actions allowing you to combine multiple steps into a custom workflow. After tailoring your app to your satisfaction, publish it by clicking the Publish button at the editor's top right corner. Once published, a Share button appears in the same location, providing various sharing options, such as QR code, link, or inviting users via email. And that's it! If you have any questions at all, please comment below. I try to answer all the comments the best I can. You can also watch my JotForm tutorial on my YouTube channel for more understanding. Thanks for watching, and take care!